Hi, this is Phil Turner from Timeform with my nap, next best and long shot for Gold Cup Day at Cheltenham. Uh, we're going to avoid the sort of nice easy, gra easy graded races and my nap's going to be in the um, Johnny Henderson Grand Annual Handicap Chase, just the 20 runners. Uh, but I do think it's the best bet of the day, not another muddle of uh, Gary Moore's. Uh, pretty low mileage for one of his ages, won three of his four starts over fences. And both of his runs this year, so yes, he's still very much doing that, very much on the upgrade. His win at Sandown last, last time, Touchwood, he didn't miss a beat with his jumping, travels really strongly. I think he'll be really suited by the demands of this race. And the form of that Sandown win's already received a boost. Um, yeah, I think he's, he's overpriced at 8-1 to one if you can get it, and uh, uh, strong fancy for that. Next best also comes in one of the sort of minefield handicaps, if you like, it's the county hurdle. And... Um, Willie Mullins has won, I think, four of the last nine renewals of the county hurdle, and um, I can understand why he's got the favourite in Whiskey Sour, but I'm actually going to go for the so-called second string in Mr Adjudicator. Paul Townend always rides this horse. He was runner-up in the Triumph last year, so we know he handles the course and distance fine, and um, he is very encouraging comeback second to a certain horse called Esprada Lane um, last time. We all know what he did in the champion hurdle on Tuesday. Um, I think he's probably the best treated in the race. And as things stand at the minute, I think he's around 14, 12 to 1. I think that price will go, and he's definitely the next best. And just the best long shot in the big race itself, uh, it's so tightly matched at the, to the top. Uh, they're all clumped together on ratings, and they've all sort of beaten each other. I think an outsider will, will be in the mix somewhere, and I think Shattered Love um, is around 28 to 1 at the minute, and she's, she'll outperform those odds. Whether she's good enough to win, I don't know, but I, th I think she'll be in the mix. So Shattered Love's the best outsider in the Gold Cup.